Hello everyone, San Bonani, Dumelang, Abshen, Molwen, Tobe. Before Namsha was allegedly shot nine times for trying to leave an abusive boyfriend, she sent out series of WhatsApp messages to people asking for prayers. She said to have been shot after she tried to abandon her lover, who was allegedly violent. She revealed through the WhatsApp that she was being abused. The lady who read her messages wrote on Twitter, Why do men hate us so much? She doesn't deserve to be shot nine times because she wanted to leave a relationship that was breaking her down. Hashtag the police aren't doing anything about it. Worst part, hashtag justice for Namsha. This is really heartbreaking to see, guys. Namla was brutally killed by someone who claimed that he loved him. Police knew about Namla's situation but didn't do anything about it. What is wrong with our society? Well, fortunately, Namla was sending evidence to her sister about everything that was happening to her. There are screenshots of WhatsApp messages and pictures. The lady explained on social media and wrote, My sister never had privacy. Ngoba, she was never granted the right to her own privacy. He lent on Ngoku. She shared everything with me. She had to block and unblock me every time um, Mr. Major S is up. Meaning when he's coming, hashtag Andy Zutula, I won't be silent. The information she gave me for a reason. Mna ifonia kebendi peng eku kaleni diye kebela epila onamsa. He epins ziguagum I knew even umkolo wake. So I am doing exactly what she told me to do. Msa gwenzika inaki. I owe her that much. Lento ilapa aiso te ijige ibe bukoki. I want the world to see. And Lali Akoguanto Ngangandi Zigwa Zizika Gazalobuti. I have watched for a very long time and today in Donele. For those who doesn't understand closer, she's saying she shared everything with her, her pin numbers for her apps, and she even knew her salary. And before she used to page Namsa's phone because she was a good person to her. She's exposing Major because that's what Namsa told her if anything happened to her. She can't even sleep at night because of what Major did to Namsa. There are so many scars on her body. Judging by the pictures circulating on social media, there's someone also said that the sad part is that the case was opened. The investigation officer is S.T. Lokani. The day after the incident happened, the police came and a statement was written. This was on the 22nd of April 2022. As a matter of fact, there has been no arrest and no one was questioned. This man broke her down emotionally, psychologically, physically until her death. The conversations are cringe with the OE Numtanaband. Well, it is believed that the man shot him nine times to ensure that she does not have any chance of survival. This is truly heartbreaking. Maybe death penalty is the only solution for these monsters who are killing women. It is so easy to kill in South Africa. Not so long ago, we were crying for God rich Gaddi's daughter, Hilary. Now it's Namla. Will it ever end though? Apparently, this major guy is a businessman and is very connected. Please share your thoughts on this one, people. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more news.